Good morning, everyone. Hello, welcome. It is Tuesday morning. Come on in, Soulfully Aligned Women. Welcome, welcome. I am just getting my candle lit, getting my space ready as we come together. So if you're new here and you haven't seen me before, my name is Janice and I come in Monday to Thursday at 8 a.m. here in the morning to have a little message, inspirational message and a little meditation with you. And uh, so Tuesday, it's Tuesday. Oh my goodness. Have you noticed how quickly time is going by lately? Good morning, Lynn. Hi. Hi, Kelly. Good morning. Hello. I wasn't sure we were going to make it on Facebook this morning because it was being really sluggish. So I'm so glad we are on and I'm seeing comments. So yay. <laughs> this is good. Okay. So time. Let's talk about time for a minute. And oh my goodness, does it feel like time is speeding up to you? You ever notice that the older you get, the faster time goes. I can remember my dad telling me that, that as you get older, time goes faster than when you're a little kid. It's like Christmas takes forever to get here. And when you're an adult, adult, it's like, oh my gosh, are we in December already? This is crazy. And even through our days, <clears throat> time is speeding up and although the message coming through is very much that time is speeding up there is a reason behind that and we're just gonna wait and see what they say about it but one thing I know is that we can control that it is the amount of stuff flowing through our head that speeds up time we've got so many things to do and the lists get longer at this time of year. So I think it's really good to take time, <laughs> to take time back, to spend some time breathing and slowing your time down. And that's what I wanna do this morning with you guys. So I'm gonna invite you to light your candle, to settle into your sacred space and, ooh, Join me closing your eyes and taking in some nice, long, deep breaths. Oh, it feels good to slow down. Breathing in through my nose and a big sigh as you let it go through your mouth. And as you do this, you are taking back your power. You're pulling your energy all in and around you from being so spread out from all the multitasking we do. So just breathe in and imagine all your power coming back to you. And as you breathe out, just let go of any tightness, any gripping, any tension. And as you come back to your normal breathing pattern, bringing your awareness into your heart. seeing all your energy gathering in the column of light in your body with your heart at the center imagine you are standing on a beautiful beach and the sun is coming up 
and the waves are gently lapping against the shore. And you decide, I'm just going to spend time here. I might be in a rush, but I'm just going to sit down here. Settle in and take some time for me. So settle into that sand facing the sun coming up over the water. And just breathe. Breathe into your heart. And feel everything in your whole body and energy field suddenly relax. Release. back into your center, breathing, breathing into your heart, and it truly is when you are feeling like you're running out of time, your energy is scattered. And so coming back and bringing back your energy into the core of your body brings you into infinite space, infinite time. And remembering to co-create with your team that when you are trying to do it all alone and you're feeling stretched and crazy, you feel that there is no time. When you lean into the guidance, what is the best thing for you to do today? And then trust that regardless of what your human mind thinks, if you trust into the inspiration and guidance, then time seems to stretch out because things get done in the flow. So as you're sitting on this beach, feel yourself ground into the earth, reach your roots down from your heart and all the way down to the core of Mother Earth. Connecting your heart to her heart. Feeling her love, support, bringing that up into your body and then reaching up from your heart all the way up to the heart of the universe going all the way up into the infinite universe to that light breathe it into your body let it flow down into you. Connecting your heart to the heart of the universe in pure alignment. And just allowing yourself to open up to possibilities today. 
being able to take a few things off your list if your list is too big. But leaning into what do you feel is coming through for you today? And just feel yourself sitting on this beach, aligned heart to heart to heart, listening to the water, feeling the breeze on your face. Perhaps today should be a rest day. Leaning into the trust that you can rest and still get it all done. Perhaps today is a day where you pick up your power again because you set it down and you keep going. Feel into it for you. today is a planning day or an organizing day or you're feeling the pull to go and take care of some chores you just want to get it out of the way but remember to work with your spirit team call them in Ask for guidance. And live your life today soul-led and soulfully aligned. And breathe into the spaces between everything that you're doing. Breathing into the gaps, as Wayne Dyer would say, breathe into the gap. Become present in those moments. Call back your power. Because it's in those moments in between the doing where the power really comes to you, where the inspiration comes, where the guidance comes, when you take the time to just sit and breathe and listen. So take a few more minutes on this beach, feeling the waves, hearing the waves, feeling the air, smelling the air. Feeling the sun on your skin, the peace and the calm.
slowly begin to come back, feeling refreshed and calm. Begin to move your body. And then open your eyes when you're ready. Ah, well, thank you for being here. We lost we lost everyone on Instagram. It shut down on us. I'm not sure what happened there. So I will place the recording in my YouTube as usual. So hello, Jill. Good morning. You so needed this. Mm. Yes, heart to heart to heart to Lynn. That is the name of my painting back here. Probably can't see the whole thing, but heart of the universe uh, to... <laughs> to the heart to your heart and then there's another light at the bottom heart of mother earth heart to heart to heart all right you switched over yay kelly i'm sorry we lost you i'm not sure when we lost everyone but um i will check and see what that looks like so i will post this recording on youtube and you can get it there i love the beach too kelly thank you <laughs> It just calms me instantly and it really, this week, I have felt the energy wiring up just like and so this was very helpful for me too. And the, the, that information of our power, you know, getting spread out, we pull it back when we come back into our center. Uh, the more multitasking we do, the more spread out our power is and the less time we feel we have. I love that. So thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> All right, so down to four spots left for the Reclaiming Your Radiance. Oh my gosh, this is getting exciting. I, um, I also have on Thursday morning, I'm gonna have to come in here a bit early because, or later, but I'm thinking early because I have another meeting with the app developers and our time difference because they're over in, <clears throat> well, the gentleman I spoke with before was in the Philippines. So the time slots are really wonky. And so I have one booked for 7.40 a.m. on Thursday. That was the soonest I could get uh, some support help. And we want to get this app done and launched, right? So that is going to be Thursday. We'll meet at 7.15 or 7.17. And um, whew, next Tuesday is the Mystic Conversation. So block your calendar for that. And make sure you're on my email list so that you get um, the Zoom link. So I need to go. I think someone is at my door. I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Thanks for being here.